Um, he's going to help me out with this because it's a little complicated because of your situation. So I just wanted to try to give you the best offer possible. So he's going to actually help um, gather some more information. And then we'll give, give you your offer today. Hey, how are you today? This is Chris. Hi, Chris. I'm good. How are you? Pretty good. Pretty good. So, yeah, she was telling me about the uh, deal here we're working on and see if uh, if there's some type of way we could kind of help you out with this and uh, get this property sold. Um, about how long have you been trying to sell it for? A week. <laughs> oh, so it's just real kind of fresh, huh? You've been getting a lot of tire kickers yeah. so far or what? <laughs> uh, yes, absolutely. Because um, from the numbers that I was uh, that I got from her, basically you owe a little bit more than the house is worth. Is that correct? Yes. Yeah. So in a case like that, we do have a program that we use sometime to help people out in your situation where you can actually sell your house. We actually uh, close through a real estate attorney and everything just like a, a, a traditional transaction. The only thing is the loan will uh -huh. stay in your name temporarily until sometime in the future where we can get it cashed out. Is that something you would consider? Uh, so basically, time in the future. Yeah, so basically that just means we would buy your house. Um, like I said, we would close through a real estate attorney, so everything's disclosed and in writing. Um, so you'll know exactly, um, uh -huh. you know, that we would we would agree to take over that payment of six fifteen per month. And then, um, you know, uh -huh. we would take full responsibility for all of the maintenance and repairs of the property okay. going forward. So you don't have to go back over there trying to, you know, fix up the vanity and whatever else the uh, house may need. Okay. Uh, we take responsibility for all of that. We get the house stabilized and, uh, you know, we try to get everything situated so we can actually get it cashed out uh, at a later date. Okay. Um, but, you know, for right now, with it being owed more than what it's worth, um, is almost, I'm, I want to say, I can't think of any other way to sell or get this house sold that I'm aware of that's even possible because, you know, somebody's not going to come along and pay outright cash for something that's worth, you know, not worth what they're paying for, if that makes sense. Right. Yeah, it does. So, yeah, that's just, a, it's just one of the programs um, we do. We do these types of deals all the time, and I just want to know if that was something you would consider. I am considering it. As we speak, yes. Okay, okay. So that's fine. And so, is there so is there anybody else that's going to be helping you with this uh, decision on uh, selling your house and things like that? No, it's in my name. Okay, that's good. So yeah, so that's the biggest thing. So long as uh, you know, we can get everything started here. Um, you are current with your loan and everything, correct? Correct. Okay, so yeah, we want to keep it that way. So um, because I know that, and it's. How long has it been vacant for? Um, since November of 2019. November, December, January, February. So went through the winter months. Uh, you winterized it, I guess, over the winter when it was uh, empty? Uh, yeah, the heat's on, though. Okay, so that's good. Because, yeah, sometimes people let yeah. those pipes burst, and that's a whole other booger there. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, we're in Ohio. We're not taking any chances like that. Exactly. Pay the bill and keep that heat on, right? So, yeah, so basically. Yeah. Like I said, that's pretty much how it would work. Uh, we would take over the payments of it. Um, and uh, like I said, the loan stay in your name temporarily for a period of time. Other than that, um, did you have any questions or anything for me? Um, so when you say this goes through a, a real estate attorney, is that right? Yes, ma'am. What's the period of time and... Since I do owe more on it than it's worth, what is the number that you're seeking to purchase it for? So what we would do is purchase it for the loan balance, whatever, how much you still owe on it, uh, approximately 68000 is that correct, something like that? Yeah. So we mm -hmm. would be buying it for the loan balance, whatever amount is still due on it. Okay. Um, and we would take over the payments of it going forward. And, uh, you know. And so the term, though, of, of how long that would remain in my name, how long is that? Uh, well, the thing is we try to get it cashed out sooner rather than later. Um, but to be honest with you, with that amount of equity in it, 
Um, I would be making up something if I was to tell you a time frame. But like I said, our our whole goal is to get it cashed out because that's basically where we're going to make money on the deal. We won't make anything on it because right. at this point until we can get it stabilized, one, where somebody can actually live in it, and two, where, you know, the market will come up a little bit and we can, you know, get it cashed out. So we basically work with people who cannot qualify for a loan at this time. But with a little bit of help from us, we help them work out their debt-to-income ratio or their uh, we, they might need time on the job or they might need a credit score boost or something like that. With a little help from us, they can go ahead and get qualified and go get their own mortgage. Get you cashed out of the deal, cash us out of the deal. And all over that period of time, the house is, um, you know, not just sitting vacant, paying mortgage on a vacant house because that doesn't help anybody. Right. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So that's basically how it would work. Um, so if that's something you you would be interested in, we can uh, draw up the agreement and uh, get it over to you. Uh, did you have any other questions or anything for me for now? I don't have any questions right at the moment. I do want to see the agreement, though. So if you want to send that, I will review that and um, get back with you. Yeah, yeah. So that's basically what it is. So basically what we would send over to you is a purchase and sales agreement that we got from our attorney. It just says that you agreed to sell us the house. We agreed to buy the house. Uh, and it, they, we basically turn that in and they do a title search. They find out if there's any liens, encumbrances, anything going on with the house that we don't know that you may not even know. You know, things come up all the time if you know anything about real estate. Oh, yeah. Um, so um, yeah. they do their title search. They come back and say, yeah, we know there's this loan on there, which we know we would buy with the loan staying in place. Uh, they will drop all the legal documents so that everybody's uh, protected in the deal. And uh, basically, we would just buy your house from that point. So it's just a, 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 it's just a regular closing. But a lot of people don't know that they can do their house that way if they want to sell it. Okay. Yep. All right. So that's, that's I me. Mean, um, like, when do I need to let you know? Yeah, so that's what I want to know. How soon could you take a look at it and get it back to us? Um, can you give me the weekend? So probably by Monday, I guess? Yeah. Okay. So we'll put that on there as well because we do have a, I think it's like an expiration date or something on it too. So yeah, we'll put that on there as yeah. well so you can review it and you know, whatever you need to do. So like I said, that's just to get the process started. There'll be some other closing documents that the attorney will draft up and everything before closing. And then if we're able to work all of this out, how soon were you looking to close? Um, ASAP. ASAP. Get out of there, huh? Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. So that'll work. Um, other than that, did you have any other questions or anything for me for now? Not right now. Uh, Rachel, do you have her email address, I guess, or no? Yes, sir. Okay, perfect, perfect. So, yep, that's all we'll need. We'll get the paperwork sent over to you, and uh, we'll get you going. All right, thank you very much. All right, thank you. Thank you, Kim. I appreciate your time. Thank we'll you, Rachel. Soon. Okay, okay. I'll talk soon. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. I ain't need to hung up on me all together. So that was a closing call I was doing with one of my students. I guess she'll call back in a second if she wants to. And there she goes. Give this video a thumbs up. Give it a like. Give it a share if you care. Hello, and thanks for calling. You are too good, sir. <laughs> I make it sound so easy, huh? <laughs> yes, that sounded so easy. Well, it's okay. I know I'll get there eventually. It's just practice. Yeah, it takes a little practice, and that's why I want you to, you know, be on, you know, phone and hear how I speak to them. I'm not promising anything overly. I'm not making no unnecessary claims or, yeah, I'm going to go out. We're going to do all this. I ain't claiming nothing, man. We're going to get this thing done, and, uh, you know, if, if we can get it done, we can get it done. Look at you. You're about to get a deal. So long as she uh, gets that paperwork, uh, get with, uh, with uh, what's her name? Virginia, she's an expert at doing contracts now, if you don't know exactly how I do it on there. And she'll help you out with getting that stuff to save the right thing. Um, I would put this I'm in so as a, I would do this probably as a wraparound mortgage. I wouldn't buy a subject to I would do it as a wrap. And, she, and I uh, sent an example over to her for it. Uh, do this as a wrap. Let's put it for the loan balance. Okay. Uh, put you what, $100 earnest money on there. Uh, you have an attorney in that area that can close that deal up. Uh, not yet. Okay. I got them back signed with them. Yeah, so that's fine. So then, um, you know, then you have to, once you get the paperwork signed off, make sure you get enough pictures, video, boots on the ground, start marketing that bad boy and try to get it, get somebody up in there. 
I mean, it, it can go kind of quick, you know, just as long as somebody will buy it, as long as we can sell it for more than what they owe. Man, I didn't think that was that good of a lead. I mean, I knew she was, I knew she got, I smelled a little desperation, but damn, I'm happy. So the trick of it is, if somebody got to want that house, though, see, you got to find a buyer. That's where the, this is where the, you know, I would say it's harder. It's, this is where, uh, the deal is really made at is on the, on this, on that other side. If you can get somebody to come yeah. give you some type of reasonable down payment and buy that house for, you know, more than what you got it for, you should be okay. Yeah. That's all gonna be tough. So, yep, as long as she uh, gets that paperwork sent over to her, let her review it. And, uh, you know, it, you'll see on the bottom of there, there's an expiration point you can put on there of midnight on Monday or something if you want. That's up to you, if you even want to put that on there. I, I do sometimes. And uh, we go okay. from there. Any other questions for now before I let you go? Please let me go. No, I'm just kidding. Um. <laughs> Um, I don't think so. All right, go knock them dead. If you have any questions, let me know. You know I'll call you. You got this. I'm rooting Thanks for you. Care. I'm rooting for you. Root, 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 root. They're going to give right, you the thank house. You. I appreciate it. All right, you're welcome. Bye-bye. All right, bye. That's how we do it, family. People give away houses all the time. All you got to do is know how to talk that talk and walk that walk. Like I said, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Give it a like. Give it a share. Hit that share button. Even if you're on Instagram Live, hit that share. Put it right into somebody's inbox. Let them know we get live out here doing some more woke stuff. So that was a call from a deal in uh, Dayton, Ohio. Uh, I was helping out one of my uh, students. Close a deal. Like I say, that comes with the coaching package. If you need some help with closing up a seller, negotiating a deal, wrapping them up, locking them up, whatever, you know, and uh, we try to do what we can to do that. So uh, any questions from you all before I roll, before I get about her and do some more woke stuff. So uh, don't forget, we'll be on Monday night, 7 o'clock Central Time, 8 o'clock Eastern, talking about that real estate talk. Who we on with this week? We on with uh, real estate dot entrepreneur. He'll be on. Make sure you check us out. We'll be on each and every Monday night. And in fact, this video is being brought to you by WokeSkipTracing.com. Get fast skip tracing as low as 15 cents per match. Not per search, per match. You only pay for what we find. If you don't get a name and email address, you don't pay. Real easy. Check it out. WokeSkipTracing.com. Get your data right back in just a few minutes. All right? So I'm about to get up out of here, family. Do what you do. Be who you be, and I'll see you. Be who you see me. Mr. I stay woke.